So uh, thank you very much for that question. I think um, I'll start by saying to whom much is given, much is expected. Uh, I came from a very humble background uh, with parents I don't have any Western education. And um, I got to where I am today partly because uh, I happened to be in an environment where there was good governance. Uh, Jack Conde was the governor of Lagos State at that time. And uh, for someone who is from the humble background that happened to have gotten good grades uh, after school, to have been able to get a government scholarship to go and study medicine abroad. Yeah. And then from there, doing a PhD, doing neurosurgery, and then becoming a professor of neurosurgery and one of the more known neurosurgeons around the world. I felt the little I could do, the least I could do was to give back to my community. And so we started with actually um, bringing Nigerian doctors abroad as the chairman then, and somebody that was leading the big. When I was in the States, I was overseeing the neuroscience service line. So we oversaw neuroscience in 12 hospitals, 14 hospitals across four different states. So Louisiana, Alabama, Mississippi, and part of Florida, Panhandle. For a lot of that we did because we had good leaders in position. So I would bring people from Nigeria, doctors, nurses, and then we donated a lot of equipment. And when they come back, we will come back with them to make sure they were well established wherever they practiced. So that was a way of giving back. But you also saw, and then I started to know what the healthcare system was like. A lot of issues, a lot of challenges. Then I negotiated for me to have more time to do that in, the, in our country. I negotiated some additional time. In America, time is money. So when you want more free time, you have to give something up. That's when I got a reduction of about 25% in my own annual income to free up a week a month to be able to come back to Nigeria and be able to do more of that. So that's the story, and uh, we had done a lot of medical missions. We had done some free medical and spine surgeries. Uh, we had trained a lot of doctors, nurses, and um, I think I've helped maybe four or five states in Nigeria in developing the neurosurgery and spine surgery area. And um, that's, um, that's what I feel like is the best thing I'm good at in terms of the healthcare, and it's, it's the best way to help. And that's, I think that's what CNN captured that somebody could give up time and effort and be able to come back to Nigeria to help. That was always kind of featured on CNN.